our weekly showcase of Nigerians doing amazing things home and abroad. This week, we check out Sadiq Gulma, a civil and environmental engineer providing access to portable water in rural communities and developing dynamic cities in Nigeria. Let's check him out. Hello everyone, my name is Sadiq Aubakar Gulma. I am trained as a civil and environmental engineer, an academic and now a change maker. Check me out. I have my first degree in civil engineering at Amadou Bella University, Zare in Kaduna State. And I have a master's degree in environmental and arid and semi-arid lands management at the Pan-African University in Nairobi, Kenya. And I'm about to complete a PhD in urban studies at Malmo University in Sweden. But my education of civil engineering was not only focused on designing iconic tall structures. There were other components addressing water resources and environmental engineering. As the founder of Green Habitat Initiative, we started designing, developing and implementing solutions addressing environmental and climate change issues with a holistic and systemic approach. And we have worked in about seven to eight states in Nigeria, increasing their access to better water, sanitation, and hygiene systems, making them more climate resilient, focusing not only on the general public, but also on smallholder farmers, on other smaller industries that are vastly affected by climate change. We worked with Sokoto State and Kebbi State Government with funding from the United States Agency for International Development to increase the access of water, sanitation and hygiene services in those two states. We reached more than 90,000 people directly in those two states. We reduced open defecation rate, which was a menace amongst the people by almost 80% in those communities. The second one I would like to highlight is a climate smart agriculture project, which we conducted together with Kaduna State Government and Kobo local government area. And we did this by installing the largest community owned solar powered greenhouse in Anchou in Kobo local government, where we empowered farmers. And we've been very fortunate to see state government, local government and beneficiaries actually take ownership of these projects and continue to do the part that they need to do to sustain the projects after our exit. My name is Sadiq Aubakar Gulma, a trained civil and environmental engineer, an academic and a social change maker. And you have just checked me out. Beautiful work, Sadiq. Now let's do a quick reminder of our top story. We looked at the bill seeking to increase women inclusion in political leadership in Nigeria. This is where we draw the curtain on this episode. The conversation ends in the studio now, but continues on our X handle at Just Nigeria TV. Let's hear your views. You can also check out more content from us from ChannelsTV.com or download the BBC World Service app, the home of your favorite BBC programs and podcasts. Until next time, I am Ayuba Ilya. Bye for now.